Ah, uh, Donkey Kong. A series that, despite being near and dear to my heart, I don't really give it that much attention. And frankly, I feel it's time to make amends, as today on a special Gaming Mysteries, we'll be taking a look at a few cancelled Donkey Kong games. Cause nothing says I love you like you're cancelled. To start things off, we're going to start with the theme of fun. And nothing is more fun than edutainment. Games that teach you about life. Or, like with Donkey Kong Jr. Math, math. And, of course, with a game like that, you need a good follow-up in the form of Donkey Kong's fun with music. Just take my word for it if you can't read Japanese. Don't worry, I can't read it either. But Donkey Kong's fun of music was to be a sequel of sorts to Donkey Kong Jr. Math, in the sense that it would be an educational title. Except instead of stupid math, it's music, which is cool, because I like music. The game was announced in 1983 in a Japanese magazine and was to feature not only Donkey Kong Jr., but some other Nintendo characters getting in on this hot musical action. Now to my knowledge, a ROM of the game has never surfaced, so there's no footage I can show you, but we do have some screenshots. The title screen, for example, gives us both two game modes, Music Quiz and Donkey Band. As to what these modes were exactly, we don't know and can only speculate. Music Quiz seems like it could have been your standard rhythm game-esque mode, while Donkey Band is speculated to be something akin to a composition mode, not unlike what was seen in Mario Paint. Which, personally, I think sounds pretty neat. I like music games. Though unfortunately, the game was cancelled with no reason as to why. It's speculated that test audiences just didn't think the game was that much fun to play, uh, which is unfortunate, but you can't really blame kids for finding an educational video game not fun. If anything, they're in the right. Next up, we have a game I'm deeply fascinated in, mostly because we know so little about it, but it was a cancelled Donkey Kong game for the GameCube, simply called Donkey Kong. The game was allegedly to be a sequel to Donkey Kong 64, continuing with similar gameplay styles, but with enhanced graphics courtesy of the GameCube and its handle. With music composed by the same people who did music for Donkey Kong Country in 64, it all sounded amazing. So amazing that there's no way in hell it could ever possibly happen in real life, because that would make me happy. Now, beyond the information I listed, little to nothing else is known about the game, as it didn't get that far into development, as Microsoft swooped in, bought Rare in 2002, and essentially killed the game, which breaks my heart. I know a lot of people hated the collecting aspects of Donkey Kong 64, but I love that game to death. So to know that Microsoft's acquisition of Rare killed its sequel is again heartbreaking. Moving on from my heartbreak though, we have a cancelled Donkey Kong puzzle game for the Game Boy Advance called Donkey Kong Coconut Crackers. Taking place from an isometric perspective, your goal would be to drop Donkey Kong's coconuts, which would break open and fill squares with paint. From there, you would form rectangles and squares with paint of the same color to score points. And as someone who's colorblind, I probably wouldn't have been very good at this game. Uh, despite my shortcomings, the game actually seemed like an interesting concept, and I for one would have at least checked it out, but once again, Microsoft swooped in, bought Rare, meaning this Donkey Kong game couldn't come to be. Though, as an upside, the game wouldn't be completely scrapped, as the game would be redeveloped and given a not-ass camera angle, utilizing Rare's original character as a replacement for Donkey Kong, Mr. Pants and was released as It's Mr. Pants. So if this title interests you at all, that's a game worth looking into as it's pretty decent. And our final game with the least amount of information out there is called The Return of Donkey Kong for the NES. Little to nothing is known about this game, but it's speculated that it was to be a follow-up to the original Donkey Kong games. You know, Donkey Kong. But with a twist, as you'd be playing as Donkey Kong, with a possibility of you throwing barrels. And going off of that, you can assume that this game would have been an inverse of the original Donkey Kong, which would have been pretty interesting to get a different perspective on the original Donkey Kong. 
Sadly though, the game never made it past the conceptual stage and will likely never be seen by anyone. Still sounds neat though. But those were some cancelled Donkey Kong games. I'd say that for the most part, I'm not too offended by the lost games, with the exception being that sequel to Donkey Kong 64, because that would have been amazing. But alas, Microsoft. So, way to go. Also, way to cancel Scalebound, you dicks. Assuming that was you, I'm gonna blame you. I'm still upset about it, is what I'm getting at. This has been Gaming Mysteries. Thank you for watching. Hello everyone, and welcome back to Enslate. You just watched the new Gaming Mysteries on some cancelled Donkey Kong games, and I hope you enjoyed the video. Uh, if you like the video and you want to subscribe or like or something like that, uh, you can do that if you want. I'm not going to force you, because I'm bad at doing it. How could I force you, really? I, I can't force you to do anything. But it'd be nice. Uh, hope you enjoyed the video regardless. Uh, at the top of the screen, there's two videos. Uh, you should be able to click on them if you want to watch them. As for what videos they are, I don't know. But, um, you know, they're there. And, uh, it's, it's something to think about. And, uh, next I'd like to move on to, uh, Patreon. Uh, and before I read the names, um, something I never do is actually ask for support on Patreon. I, I just kind of thank the people who have supported me on Patreon, but I, I never actually asked, hey, if you like my content and you want to see more, check out my Patreon, because I'm bad at being that person um, and self-loathe. Uh, but with the last few videos I've uploaded uh, since... I want to say it was like September or October. YouTube has disabled ads on every one of those. Uh, the last one I did, for example, the uh, Gaming Mysteries on Steven Seagal's The Final Option, uh, that was deemed inappropriate for advertisers, but YouTube didn't tell me why is it inappropriate. It's because he has a stupid ponytail and you can't put ads on that? I don't know. They don't tell me. Um, and it's getting to the point where, like, I need to ask for help, but I don't want to, because I'm stubborn. But, uh, if, if you like the videos I do and you want to see more of them, uh, consider checking out my Patreon. That just churned my gut for saying that, God. Uh, so let's move on. I, I got, I got thank yous to thank, thank people thank the people on patreon who support me god i hope i don't cry and so from the bottom of my heart i'd like to thank i made this account just for yuri thank you very much snooper lily star frame frame <laughs> i already screwed up lily star flame thank you by the way for supporting me on twitch as well it's much appreciated. Uh, thank you, Mr. Mohawk, Nikki Batelli, Moose Man, Kevin Reagan, Blinker002, Johnny Von Tungen, Michael Holder the Second, Daniel Howler, Ragnar the Green. Hello, Ragnar. What's up? There's a Yuri of Wind Discord, by the way. I forgot to mention that. Um, I'll try and put the link in the description if I can find the link. Uh, but thank you, Airman. You're so difficult to beat. Uh, thank you, Joseph Perez, Amy Strange, Kim Ellis, Brian, JJ Summers, Nikki Layman, D Man's Land, who's actually in the chat right now, I think, because I'm recording this live. Hi, D Man. Um, thank you, Nolan, Christina, Crunchy Face, Fernando Silva, Rodrigo Derez, Beautiful Yoshi, Nad Potter. Oh, Nat Par Potter. That I'm illiterate uh thank you kitsune noel kurai may madison stop to michael p efray 684 sally from three ice cube show christopher barba brendan wilbanks lennon walrus pokemaniac link the eighth link v i i i 
it, it's one of those. That guy, uh, wait, yeah, that guy in the store. Thank you, that guy in the store. Thank you, Matthew Newitt, Hannah B., Kyle Nicholas, Jameson Wiley, Diego A. Lopez, friend, Carrot? Yeah, I'll go, I'll go with that. Alec Dixon, Patrick Policio, Polis, Palacio, Patrick Palacio. I think if I screwed up your name, uh, you uh, you can beat me up. Um, thank you, Desmax, Chrome Party. Oh, I don't want to go to a Chrome Party. Uh, Rebecca Twixberry, John Paul Hoare. It's Hoare, by the way. I remembered that. Uh, thank you, Darth Penguin, Mark Ryan, Mitchell Shore, Abdul Kareem Torres, Stebola, The Wheels on the Bus Go Die, 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 Erlen Mattis Rees, A.O. Breezy, Richard Lahiff, Greg Wolf, Mr. Bowler, Robert, Sergio, Diego Martinez, M. Gamers, Mio Kurashima, Gisteria, Escape Route British, thank you, Rory O'Carroll, Kimpachi Ramasama, Anthony Mang, Squiggly Kip, Fat D. Always thank Fat D. In the house. Uh, thank you, Lucas Basque, Eric Camacho, Jonathan Klaus, Ryan Cole, Jacob Epler. Welcome back, bro. Is that me? Uh, problematic and everyone who supported me on Patreon. Thank you all um, for doing so. Uh, it means the world to me um that you'd want to support uh some depressed anxiety ridden video creator on the internet um so thank you uh from the bottom of my heart i love you all even if you're not a patreon i love you too um uh, but that's about do it for Enslate. let's check on the time right here Hey, we didn't go to eight minutes. I thought this was going to go to eight minutes, but we didn't. That's cool. Um, so, yeah. I uh, hope you enjoyed the video. Um, I'll see you soon because I got some more videos coming up soon. Because that's how that works. Um, and I got some doctor's appointments. So, until next time. My square... My square... Oh, shit. My chair squeaked. And I gotta go. Uh, this has been Yuri of Wind, and this has been Enslate. Uh, thank you for watching. I love you all. I forgot where the stop button was. It's right here. <laughs>